All right, uh, welcome back to my favorite game in Gabby's and yours. Yeah. Or at least for now. Yeah, um, yeah so far. Yeah, Doki Doki. Uh, it's been a while since we've actually played this. It's uh, been almost, it'll be a month. For, for us, for you, it'll be a week. Yeah, yeah. So for us, yeah, It. I, I looked at the timestamp and I'm like, huh, it's almost been a month. So we do not remember what's going on. All we know is Natsuki thinks something is not bad. <clears throat> I'll just go ahead and read that. Not bad, right? No, it's left. <laughs> I was really confused for a solid <laughs> second. I thought that head towards more of a, you're dead to me. No, I was like, <laughs> what? <laughs> I was confused. Okay. Um, it's quite a bit longer than yesterday's. We just read her poem. Okay, here we go. Okay. Yesterday's was way too short. I was just warming up. I hope you didn't think that was the best I could do. Oh, yeah, it was. <clears throat> no, of course not. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, the message is pretty straightforward in this poem. I doubt I have to explain it. I can't get you because I don't remember it. I know, right? <laughs> Sometimes you can explain complicated issues with much simpler analogies. And if it helps people realize how stupid they're... <laughs> and it helps... <laughs> I read that wrong. And it helps people realize how stupid they're being. Like anyone would agree that the subject of this poem is an ignorant jerk. Um, do, you, do you know people like that? Do you, do you, of course. Do you, do you have some hidden feelings there, Natsuki? Clearly. <laughs> of course. <laughs> I'm a psychopath. <laughs> <laughs> it's been about how everyone thinks my... That doesn't matter. It could be about anything. I wrote it to be easy to relate to. I can't read I was right about now. To say, you have trouble there? Yeah, I really am having... I'm struggling <laughs> to read. <laughs> we just finished... In in our timeline, we, we, we've we finished the murder game and... Uh, yeah, it was rough. Um, mm. Everyone has some kind of weird hobby or guilty pleasure... Something that you're afraid if people find out, they'll make fun of you or think less of you. I'm really struggling. Um, but that just makes people stupid. Cute girl, girl. <laughs> Who cares what someone likes as long as they're not hurting anyone? It, and it makes them happy. I think people really need to learn to respect others for liking weird things. Well, you're definitely right. At least I can relate to that. Can you? Yes? I mean... Yes? What? Yes. And I'm sure a lot of other people can too. But apparently not, Brandon. I didn't say I... I was asking you! Oh, okay. You know... I'm glad that you can appreciate this kind of writing. I mean... I know I was talking about that yesterday. But I've been... Well, I've been enjoying sharing my writing with you, so so consider yourself lucky, okay? <laughs> well, thanks for being honest. What's that supposed to mean? I have no idea. Oh, I love that line. I'm always honest. Jeez. Just look forward to tomorrow, too, okay? All right, I will. Crazy person. Okay, everyone. We're all done reading each other's poems, right? I have something extra planned today. Uh -oh. So if everyone could come sit at the front of the room. Is it about the festival? Well, sort of. Uh, do we really have to do something for the festival? It's not like we can put together anything good in just a few days. My bad, that's me. We'll just end up embarrassing ourselves instead of getting any new members. You're... That's okay, I swear I will kill you. That's a concern of mine as well. I don't really do well with last-minute preparations. Don't worry so much. 
I will kill you all if you do not follow my instructions. Why are you trying to kill everyone off? The murder game has given me ideas. Really? And it's pissed me off. So, rage. We're going to keep it simple, okay? <coughs> we won't... My voice just stopped off, son. We won't... <laughs> I just need to do it. We won't need much more than a few decorations. Sayori has been working on posters, and I've designed some pla pamphlets. I knew what the word said, but reading it <laughs> threw me off. Yeah. Some pamphlets we can give out during the event. Okay, that's great and all, but that doesn't tell us what we're actually going to be doing for the event. Ah, uh, sorry. I thought you heard about it already. No, of course not. Why else would I be asking, Monica? What? We're going to be performing. Performing? I'm sorry, let me redo that. Monica. <laughs> and a one, and a two. Yeah. We're, we're, we, mm, shut it, uh, mm, we're going to be having a poetry performance. Oh, no. You're infecting me, Gabby. I'm sorry. <laughs> Each of us are going to choose a poem to recite during the event. Can I pick one of y'all's instead of mine? No, I don't just want to read your words. I do want to read my words. Do I get to read my words? No, it does exactly. not matter. It does not matter. But the cool part is we're also going to let anyone else come up and recite poems to I don't know why, but that didn't sound right. Sayori's putting it all on post on, on all the posters in case anyone wants to prepare ahead of time. <laughs> Crack. Oh, my bad. Yeah, that's you. Siri, who's been coloring a poster, holds it up for us to see. Are really? You... Just imagine it. Just ima imagine it. Are you kidding me, Monica? You didn't You didn't already start putting those posters up, did you? What posters? Uh, well, I did. Do you really think it's that bad of an idea? Yuri does. Look at her face. Yuri just looks like... I gotta use the bathroom. She was like, I don't like this idea. Uh, <clears throat> well, no. It's not a bad idea. Then what but, is your problem? But I didn't sign up for this, you know. There is there is no way I'm going to be performing in front of a group of people like that. Uh, I, I agree with Natsuki. I could never in my life do something like that. Imagining it, Yuri shakes her head in fear. Guys? No, Sayori. <laughs> well, what? Stop. Don't ruin it. I understand where they're coming from. Why did you say it like Remember that? that Natsuki and Yuri have never shared their poems with anyone until just a couple of days ago. <laughs> Turning the motion down. It's a lot to ask for them to recite their poems out loud to a whole room full of people. If it's a festival, it's not going to be in a room, right? No, it will be, usually. Well, it de it depends. The festival is like they set up, like, booths. They can set up booths. Yeah, but the festival should be outside. It's not, that, it's not that kind of festival. Me, 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 me. It's the, it's the club festival, so they, like, and if sometimes they do it in, like, they do performances in, like, the theater, the auditorium or whatever. So that's probably okay. what they're going to be doing. Sidebar. This looks like, like, Sayori woke up <laughs> too early at a, at a slumber party. Natsuki's having a nightmare. And the other two are just, uh. <laughs> I mean. I see it, and I'm upset. And Sayori, Sayori's just there going, uh, is breakfast ready? Nope. I guess I kind of overlooked that. Uh, so I'm sorry. Aw. It's okay, Monica. We love you. Dot, dot, dot. Do we? Do we? Do we? But I still think we should give it our best. 
we're the only ones responsible for the fate of this club. If we start the event and each put on a good performance, then it will Im inspire others to do the same. Hey, watch where your finger is. You're gonna poke my eye out. Ah! I didn't even notice that because I'm just reading <laughs> the words. I know. And the more people who perform, the better we'll be able to show everyone that literature is what literature is all about. Yeah! It's a it's about it expressing your feelings, being intimate with yourself, <laughs> finding new horizons, and having fun. That is so not right, Sayori. I mean, that is right, Sayori. And and uh, mm, and it's those reasons that we're all in this club today. Don't worry. Don't you want to share with that with others? I cannot talk. To inspire them to find the same feelings that... <laughs> I don't know why, but just sit my head. I'm here to inspire them to find the same feelings that brought you here in the first place. I don't know why. I'm delusional. Who are you? I know you do. I know we all do. And if it all... Mm. <laughs> oh, God. And if it all... <laughs> and it... And... <laughs> and if all... <laughs> Just... What is wrong? And... If, <laughs> Shut if, up. Don't do that. Don't do that. It's going to be. And if all it takes is standing in front of the room for two minutes and reciting a poem, finally got through it. My God. Uh, I really want to say, and if all of it takes. <laughs> yeah, I know. My brain was heading words, but at the same time, my brain was going, why are you heading words? Then I know you can do it. Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. Natsuki and Yuri remain silent. Siri looks worried. <laughs> I, I guess that leaves me no choice. I agree. You have sealed your fate. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't think it's too much to ask. I think that Siri and Monica have been trying really hard to get new members. The least we can <clears throat> do is help them out a little bit. Well, maybe, but... Dot, dot, dot. It looks like Natsuki doesn't have any arguments left. Uh, okay, fine. I guess I'll just have to get over it. Get it over with. That's right. Learn your place. All right. Phew. Thanks, Natsuki. What about you, Yuri? <laughs> Yuri dejectedly glances around at everyone else's expectant faces. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Sigh. I guess I, I, I guess I don't really have a choice. I'm not a fan of peer pressure. <laughs> That's everyone. Just say, Yuri, come on now. Shut your pie hole. You're the best, Yuri. This club is seriously going to be the death of me. Me too, Yuri. Oh, gosh. Sweat. 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 You'll be fine, Yuri. But anyway. Let... <coughs> Excuse me. Let's move on. Let's move on to the main event. There we go. My God. I want each of you to choose a poem of yours. We're going to practice reciting them in front of each other. No way! Monica! This is too sudden! Well, if you... Mm, well, if you can't recite your poem in front of the club, how do you expect to do it in front of strangers? Oh, no! Don't worry. Be happy. Nice. Even though I hate this song. I'll start <laughs> off to help everyone feel a little more comfortable. Can I go now? Uh, 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 of course. Now let's see. 
Monica flips through her, I forgot I was supposed to read that. Monica flips through her notebook to the specific poem she has in mind for herself. She then stands behind the podium. The uh, oh, great. The title okay. of this poem is The Way They Fly. <laughs> Monica. <laughs> I was like, it's Monica, dramatic pause. Uh, no, Monica begins reciting her poem. Um, Do we get to read it? Do we get to read it? Well, hold on, hold on. Click, click. Her clear, confident voice fills the room. Feels? <laughs> fills the room. Feel. Feel. Uh, more than that, her inflection is pristine. She knows exactly how to apply emotion behind each line she recites, bringing the words to life. We're not is, even going to get her to read the poem? Is this something she's done before, or is she simply a natural? I glance around me. Everyone has their eyes on Monica. Suri looks amazed. Yuri has an intense expression on her face that I don't understand. Finally, Monica finishes the recitation. The four of us applaud. Monica we demon read it. That was no nope. crap. That was a ripoff. What a ripoff. Uh, Monica takes a breath and smiles. That, uh, that was so good. She's saying that it was so good, but at the same time, she's going, Oh my God, she's killed everyone! And on that note, on the next episode... <laughs> <laughs>